what's up guys this is G welcome to my channel today we're at one of the prettiest places in Oahu Hawaii we're at Waimanolo country farms you can see the sunflowers in the background as well as the mountain the ocean is not too far away as I was coming I saw some food stand there is a lot to see and I cannot wait to show you more Oimanolo Country Farm is located in a 52 acres of land. It's been in the family for six generations, over 70 years, and started in 1948. From 1948 to 1960, the produces that grew here were broccoli, kai choy, green onion, Chinese peas, sweet potatoes, and tomatoes. From 1960 to 1972, melons were the most popular produce growing here. From 1972 to 2009, corn was the most popular produce growing in this farm. And from 2010 to the present, sunflower is uh, one of the most popular produce growing here as well as corn. I am super excited to try something new which is eating sunflower head. They have a stem that uh, actually prepares them. So I'm going to show you what they do and how it tastes. Sunflower heads. Austin here prepares. Uh, how exactly do you prepare the sunflower heads? So the ones we roast are the younger sunflowers. Uh, they look more like this. You can see a sunflower in the front where it has fully developed seeds and they're really dark. These are more mature, very hard. So roast the young ones um, because they're really soft. They're not that mature yet. So when you roast them on the grill, you're gonna roast them head down until they get really hot and charred and these outer seeds get soft they are ten dollars each yes ten dollars a head people it's cash, cash or... or card okay yeah we accept both are there different kinds of sunflowers there is so our variety that we grow is a uh, crest field it's called and that's a um, oil, sunflower oil. The seeds that you'd buy in the store for like roasted sunflower seeds would be mammoth. It's called, their heads are huge. Like I would say like a foot maybe. Mm -hmm. And they grow like nine feet tall. They're wow. very big. Yeah, they live up to their name. Do you prepare it overnight? We make our own garlic butter. Everything here that you see here we try and sell. We usually grow ourselves or make it ourselves. Late March. Uh, to early April is our first event. So that's more of like a spring event. And then we'll have another one in June. That's a summer event. Okay. And then we'll do fall, we do our pumpkin patch. So the best thing to do is just call and find out more. Yeah, our website, uh, Facebook, and Instagram is all Waimanalo Country Farm. We always try and keep uh, it up to date all the time. I'm gonna oil this one. Mm -hmm. Oil the head. Then after that, we're gonna go, we're gonna put garlic butter on it right away. It's gonna melt right over the whole head. Look at this buttery, cheesy sunflower seeds. It tastes really good. The sunflower seed is easy to chew. The taste goes really well with the taste of butter and parmesan cheese and, and garlic. This is so unique. I think oh, yeah, probably like one of the most unique things I've tried. Definitely recommend this guy. Try it out. Got a corn from this stand. You can buy corns, you can buy lemonade. 
9.30. I hear you have some famous drinks. Could you tell me a little more about yeah, them? Yeah, we fresh squeeze every day. It's called Nalo Made Lemonade. Oh. We do fresh fruit purees. So we have strawberry, mango, pineapple, and Li Hing. Want to try a flavor? Oh, I would love to try the mango one. Mango? Is it all the flavors they have? Oh, nice. Thank you. You're welcome. Look at that. So pretty. Cannot wait to try this. It's hot outside, so it's actually perfect for this weather. Ooh, that's refreshing. I love this. This is so good. Can you tell us about the pineapple one? Yeah. I love the mango one. What? That was definitely from the hook. So, uh, kind of hook. so it is pineapple lemonade. The lemonade is the actually like the, the top flavor and there's okay. subtle hints of the pineapple. So if you didn't know and they just said here's some lemonade, you maybe wouldn't even pick up on it. Uh -huh. But I think that's a good thing because it's and it's a nice balance between citrus, sweet and like cold. Especially out here in the field, so it's really nice to, to kind of be refreshed this way. Thanks for sharing. Yeah, no problem. Cheers. There's a group of uh, artists painting here. Let's go check out their art. Hello. How are you? Good, how are you? Good, thank you. That's pretty. Yeah. Thanks. I like it. Thank you. What a beautiful place to bring your family and have a fun family day. Have some delicious beverages and getting to take pictures with this beautiful sunflower field. I have had a lot of fun today. I hope you had fun as well and I cannot wait to show you more in the future. Please make sure to like, subscribe and share. I will see you next time.